So it's been a while since we talked about the real estate market in Hawaii and since COVID when everything shut down and everything opened back up, it was like a feeding frenzy, right? A lot of people from California, from New York, they all decided they, they want to get the heck out and uh, they sold their homes and moved to Hawaii, right? Well, the interest rates were at all time low, right? So everybody was buying like crazy. You know, the, there was 20 offers per property, right? Wow. So, you know, that's a low, like there's more than that, right? And every everybody was putting an above asking price offer, so. And waiving their contingency. No contingencies, no home inspections, wow. whatever. Yes, yeah, as, as fast as they can get into that property, you know, they were fighting against all other people, so. And they were doing whatever. Overbidding, yeah. By how much was? Well, I mean like. At least 20,000. At least 20,000 was the, the starting point. That was the starting point. Wow. You would see 100,000 over and things like that. It was crazy stuff, crazy yeah, stuff yeah. that you, you won't see 2%. I don't know. Interest Maybe, rate. Yeah, yeah, interest rates. I don't know ever again in my lifetime. Whatever. I think it would have to take another like COVID type event, right? Yeah. So, and people are smart now. Like, we remember the 2008 crash. We definitely remember the COVID crash. So if if even interest rates drop down to four percent, right now it's currently at seven. Right. It's down to four. It's well, going to be a buying frenzy again. Because you could, you're you gonna pay half of the amount, almost half the amount on your mortgage, right? Right, right. Even at, at five, you know, around there, like people are gonna start jumping back into the market. So, yeah, right now the rates, and especially like two weeks ago, they were 7.5, right? So, and now it's fluctuating between like a little under seven to 7.5, you know, close to touching the eights, right? So it's a super, like, you know, it's, it's high for what it is, but historically it's not really high, right? If, right. Back in the day, it was 15 to 20 percent was the, you know, like a norm, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, but that was for a short period uh, in the 80s. And, and uh, when you go back and you look at the prices, at least relative to your income, it was still kind of affordable. Right, right, right. So and here then, now in yeah. Hawaii, 15 would kill us. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. But right now, the good thing is, you know, the, uh, all the lenders I talk to are expecting the rates to drop, right? They, they're not dropping as fast as they expected because they thought by the end of the year, you know, we would get to six, around six or whatever, right? Doesn't look like that's gonna happen. So now they're they're thinking next year, and right. right. And so the hope is that it will go down. You know, no one, no one's, no one can see the future. You know, like right. they were wrong actually at the end of this year. So, but it looks like it's gonna go down eventually.